Good day mga Kabayan Techers! This is your The Kabayan Tech. Today is another uh, Tuesday repair. So let's begin! So as per my experience, so uh, on the video that I had, which is which I posted the link below, and also a video that you're seeing right now, um, I bought a JCB uh, a JC home button, um, copied the serial number of the original home button, and put it on using the JCV one S. Uh, the only thing that I notice as per my experience would be the button is a little bit finicky meaning uh, there are times that it will just press by itself then the button will work of course uh, when you press the button it goes to the home screen and, and so on and so forth the only thing that w would not work would be the touch ID so upon researching and, and asking a few, a few questions from some of my uh, tech friends they said that it should match up with another cable that you have to buy from the JC store. I bought one and use it for a week. I found out that it is better to use alongside with the home button. So the original screen has um, its home button cable attached to it, which is this one. On the JC store or when you go to AliExpress, uh, they sell the JC version uh, JC ID this one for the iPhone 8 so I have an iPhone 8 so this is a cable that you buy separately I have it uh, pasted here already so I can't remove it and it has its own uh, connector for the home button what I notice about this cable it's not just a plain cable it has its own chip that controls the um, issue that is a little bit finicky on just using the home button the, the phone thinks that it is like a, a foreign object right so it will work but sometimes it will try to and will create uh, pressing action on the screen I will post all the links where I, I bought it I'm not sponsored by JC ID uh, but I'm using their products so my purpose for this one is to have a usable phone that uh, the home button works as I expected it to be except the touch ID if you're going to ask me if um, you could restore the touch ID there are different videos from different um, repair shops that they actually tear down the home button and replace it with another cable or uh, the most expensive one is go to the Apple store and replace your whole screen and they're going to reprogram it the reason why the home button is always paired to the logic board of the phone this one so if you replace it and even if you transfer the serial number of the original home button using jcv one s it's just transferring the the serial number in in this case i was looking for a cheaper option because i'm okay with just putting in uh the passcode on this phone and and not have like the functionality of the uh, touch id assumingly this is the original uh, original screen so I cut this part with the scissor and also I cut this one over here. Uh, just be careful not to cut anything on this cable because this is the backlight and also this is for the display, the first uh, connector, okay? So after that, what I did is I used the JC Home Flex cable and there is a, um, a double-sided tape on, on the other side. Before you tape it, make sure that you connect the home button first and then tape it there will be like um, a blue tab that you could take out and have it to stick onto this one so this would be the full setup of this screen so i use uh, a captain tape just to hold it then same procedure we're going to connect uh, the jc home button flex and i'm going to turn it on or let me just put everything in when I go to from let us say uh, the Safari and I press the home button this will work as I expected it to be press uh, the two buttons this you could actually do that part you could also invoke Siri if this one is turned off or on the standby time a standby screen you just press the home button and it will go back and then ask for the passcode for this one so that's it mga kabayan techers if you have any questions comments or concerns just write them down below kindly click the subscribe button and also the bell button for you to get notified give us a thumbs up if you like this video again thank you very much and have a good day